Okay, I'm going to talk about the area of a circle. Actually, the area inside a circle. Um, well, here it is. Here's my circle. Not the most accurate circle you've ever seen. The radius r. Area equals pi r squared, where pi equals 3.14159, so on. And r equals the radius which is this distance here from the centre to the circumference. So the area is pi r squared, pi r squared. So if r equals 3, then the area equals pi times 3 squared, and of course 3 squared is 9, so it's pi times 9. And if I wanted an answer, I'd get my calculator, which is here. Uh, if I go to scientific view, I think I've got pi here. Yeah, there's pi. Three point, look, one, four, one, five, and all these other digits here. Times nine, because that's three, uh, that's, that nine is there, it's three squared. Equals 28.27. 28.27. And if r was three metres, then this area here would be that metres squared. Now, I'm a mathematician, so I define a circle in terms of its radius, but my brother is an engineer. He defines a circle in terms of its diameter. And you don't need to be a rocket scientist. Well, he's nearly a rocket scientist, my brother. He's an aerospace engineer, but it's, it's halfway to a rocket scientist. D. Uh, D equals 2R. So that means that R equals D over 2. So... My area is pi r squared, but that's equal to pi times d over 2 all squared, which is pi d squared over 4. So the mathematician defines it in terms of the radius. The engineer, well, my brother anyway, defines it in terms of the diameter. And the area is equal to pi d squared over 4. There you go. Stop.